Hello and welcome to Hawthorne, California. We're just standing outside of the Boring Company tunnel entrance. We can see the watchtower right there and a little tiny building made out of bricks and then a crane and some of the TBMs just right over there. This tunnel, I think, or sorry, this tent has the tunnel entrance. And then there's a press tent for tonight's um, reveal at 8 p.m. So I'm just gonna walk over there and kind of talk. I just uh, finished up with uh, another interview with Will and the A Boring Revolution, his YouTube channel. So give that a, a like. We were talking about, um, you know, what might be revealed tonight, whether it's uh, the pod, um, that will be autonomous or uh, more details about different routes um, that are around the world. And, and thanks, Nice YouTube, for doing the coming over from the Boring Channel. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask. I'm just going to walk over there and kind of go in front of the security team. There's already a lot of security. Um, but yeah, it's pretty quiet. The uh, TBMs are just right there. They're a lot bigger than I thought. Uh, definitely one car would fit in the tunnel at a time, not two. Uh, but, you know, it's it's just uh, pretty amazing that they were able to pull this off. Um, I can see some panels over there that um, are near the tent um, that reinforce the tunnel entrance. And I was going to be here a little bit later, but I have to catch my flight um, back to Denver. Um, I don't know. Is there anything else you want to hear about while being here? Um, a lot of Teslas, a lot of uh, media. I went up to the press tent and I think there's a lot of media that will be here later tonight at 8 p.m. Um, Yeah, it's just uh, pretty remarkable. So this test tunnel will not be like for public use. Um, it's just going to be for uh, testing pods and the Hyperloop pod competition and testing the autonomous cars. Um, still no details on kind of what uh, kind of autonomous cars will be in there. But let me just bring over my live chat. Well, the, well, I'll, okay, I know I will not be there for the live event broadcasting, unfortunately. I have to get on my airplane um, <laughs> to go back to Denver. But, uh, yeah, it's kind of remarkable. Um, this has been a long time coming for the Boring Company. They've worked really hard, and, you know, it's uh, a lot of hard work. I'm looking at a panel um, that... I think is a kind of a test section for the um, let's see where are they oh it's right there that's the panel it's a test section for the large tower that's right over there and um, that was assembled pretty fast actually I thought there would be two towers but there's just one um, and I went to the uh, brick store which is um, there's like an airport right there and it's like on the other side two miles away and there's not much to see over there, but there's the uh, the exit where they removed the boring machine um, is located over there. Yes, the tunnel will also be used for Hyperloop testing um, for the, at least for the SpaceX pod competition, which will happen in July this summer with university teams, but um, also perhaps for uh, the boring company's own Hyperloop pods um, as I think, Elon Musk is still interested in fully testing that out, and um, yeah, I've met a couple other uh, people that are just kind of waiting around. Um, I think there's a lot of interest, a lot of, uh, I think, Tesla owners got invited to this, um, and you know, it's kind of a, a broad cross-section of, of interested parties that are kind of waiting around here, uh, but it's 
it's pretty quiet so far, so we're just gonna kind of wait for a little bit. Sorry that this uh, live stream was a little late, but it's been a long day. And I do see um, some palm trees that are through the, the hole right there. Um, and I think those are the snail habitat, Gary's snail habitat. And uh, this uh, boring machine that we're looking at right here um, is the first boring machine. Um, and uh, it's just kind of um, just dug up out of the ground. And thanks, Ryan, again for that. Uh, cheers <laughs> as I kill a little bit of time. Um, but yeah, it's, it's just a really nice day in uh, Hawthorne, California. Um, this live stream tonight will be um, really interesting to watch. I don't know any of the details. I haven't met anybody that will actually has a ticket to go in. Um, so it'll be, it'll be fascinating to hear their impressions. And um, Yeah, the, the Boring Company's uh, come a long way. Um, are there any other questions? <laughs> As I, I do see a little bit of dust coming up, uh, possibly from a fan in the tunnel. Um, I was going to check out another location where they um, are digging up the, um, the footprint for the garage, uh, but I don't think there's much to see over there. It's right along a busy road, and um, I didn't really want to have to cross the busy road. but. Uh, the Hyperloop Pod Competition Tunnel is still over there on um, Jack Northrop Boulevard, and um, it looks good as ever. Um, nothing's really changed over there. A lot of action at SpaceX here. I just, you know, I'm aware of a lot of employees working really hard, and focused, and um, a lot of boring company employees too, uh, working hard. And uh, I think they've been up pretty late nights for the last couple days um, and we're right next to a Lowe's hardware and so I've been uh, just kind of milling around the area today and um, seems pretty focused and again I said I went over to the um, other uh, location where the brick store will be and there's not much to see half of the building is painted white and then the other half of it is still kind of the, the other business that was previously there. Um, but, uh, yeah, I heard one rumor that the bricks will be different colors tonight. Um, so that'll be interesting. I don't know any of the dates of when it's opening um, or anything, but, uh, yeah. So if there's no other questions, I'm going to walk around and take some bee footage and um, you can tweet at me in the Hyperloop uh, if you want any specific photos, but I um, hope you're having a good evening and have enough uh, adult beverages to last uh, into the evening, <laughs> as it will be a late one. <laughs> so uh, I'm going to end this from Hawthorne. Um, it's been really fun. The tower is pretty tall. Um, it looks pretty uniform and solid. Um, and there are literally wooden doors on top of the ta channel, or sorry, on top of the, the doors over there. You should ask random people, walk by if they're aware of what's going on. Yes, I think everybody's aware of what's going on. I've seen some people um, standing where the Lowe's hardware is uh, and just like take photographs pointing this direction. And unfortunately, it's directly into the sun and uh, Crankshaw Avenue is really busy. So I don't really want to go over there. It's even more loud. But, um, yeah, the TBM is just really white and really large, and um, that we might hear more about that tonight, um, whether it's new technology or uh, a new design that's being built for the TBM, and um, yeah, that's about it. So I'm going to end this from Northern California, and uh, thanks for, for waiting. I just did a, another interview with um, A Boring Revolution with Will, so if you want to check out his channel, he's going to do more of a, a live stream later 
when Elon's uh, on and I'll be on my airplane. So the vibe is very, very chill, <laughs> very California. It's a cool afternoon. Um, not really a lot of people. There's a little bit of security and the press tent's like ready to go. And um, the press tent has a kind of those green things over there. Um, and there's no pamphlets or no really anything that I can tell. Hopefully they have power charging stations over in the press tent. Um, but I don't see any pallets of bricks or I don't see any, um, you know, stuff or, or anything. So, um, yeah, pretty, pretty relaxed. There was a power outage um, in this mini mall area. So I think what you're hearing is Lowe's own generator kicking in. And I don't hear any generators or anything over at SpaceX or the Boring Company side. And they have power because there's lights on and stuff, so that's good. Um, so I think that's it. I'm going to head out. And thanks for watching. Um, subscribe and stay in the loop. All right. Bye-bye.